organizations are searching for an edge a lot of the time. And, and one of the ways that they think they can get an edge is by exploiting scale in some form, yeah, procurement, um, you know, relationships, you know, selling multiple products to the same per all of that sort of stuff. So people are thinking, I want to try and exploit scale to get an edge because I can't see an edge somewhere else or it's it's a big opportunity for me. Um, and they move to matrix management. They start thinking in an organization that hasn't had matrix management to one way or another, we're going to have to have some metrics management here because if we don't have the sort of cross of a product category or the cross of procurement going across the general management, we won't be able to exploit scale. And yet I know that every time you put in metrics management, it is an unbelievably painful experience for everybody. And I was, I was trying to think, why is that? You know, why is putting in metrics management such a challenge because rationally you know you say well we'll all buy the same air travel so we'll save a lot of money so this is very rational and all that sort of stuff but then i was thinking about it in the bios context right and and it is ambiguity you are driving ambiguity in the organization when you when you introduce matrix management because you're saying you've got two bosses Right? You've got two sets of objectives where before you had one. One, you just had to make profit. Now I have to make profit, but I have to buy from this guy who's more expensive in my country, but it's che cheaper overall, somebody tells me. right? So you, matrix management introduces ambiguity in an organization. And I think, and I haven't tested this, by the way, but I think that some of the bios thinking is really important in that context. The first step is to say, well, don't put the matrix in way down the organization. And some people do, you know, they, they sort of put the dual reporting line into the most junior person in the organization. Well, the, you know, if you did any of this stuff from BIOS and organizing and complexity and fitting roles, you'd say, that's nuts, right? Because you're placing, you know, you're designing in ambiguity from above right down. So first of all, in the principles, get it as high as possible, right? The second thing is retinize. That's what you've done to people. You've, you've, you've made their life more um, ambiguous. So give them tools, make sure they're right for it. Give them tools to manage that ambiguity. Um, so I think designing the moment of putting or changing metrics management is a moment at which you look at, is the role right for the people I've got in the role? in the context of self-inflicted ambiguity rather than some of the ambiguity that the world has placed upon us that, we, that we've been talking about earlier. So I think it's important in metrics management.